And I went to the screen. Uh, hello everybody. My name is Poke Emblem. And <coughs> whatever quartz I have does not matter to you. Oh, I know this is going towards Lots Bell 4, so don't bother. I have a QP shortage, but we'll get to the points. So it's as you can see from this little thing right at this little section called 500 Days Total Login. Technically, I started playing this game 515 days ago. Close to it. Well, probably will be 515 by the time I upload this. No, I'm not gonna exactly, um, uh, well, um, wait till 8 p.m. just to upload this video because it's ridiculous and it's already like 4 p.m. And I'm not rolling for savers because, as you can see, let's just do a bit overview of my account. So I have three SSR sabers being Benny Emma, Sigurd, and Arthur. Two SSR archers, technically three, but I burned one because reasons being that I hopefully and then I realized that SSR no longer curses me, so I can say no more Ryan burning. But the other two SSRs that not burn is Tesla and Gilgamesh. Tesla's the only one that's not I just, yeah, you're probably thinking, why didn't you max send your Tesla? I'll get to it this week. I promise on that. Because he's the only SSR that I need to max extend. And yet I extend, max extended reigns first. So that's fun. Um, yeah, there's Gilgamesh. I have two SSR Lancers, being Enkidu and Karna. Um, two SSR Riders being Reigns and Meeb. Three SSR Casters being Skahawk Scotty, Swarzazade. I may have butchered her name, but let's face it, I don't understand. Well, I'm a dumb moron. So forgive me if I mispronounce a name. And lastly, Elmeroy II. Or Waver Velvet. But I call him Waver anyways. One SSR Berserker being Koo Alter. Kukulain Alter. Um, only SSR Foreigner. Um, okay, fine. Um, ruler is John the Ark. John the Ark Alter's the Avenger. And Abigail Williams is the only Foreigner I have. And the first new class I was exposed to. This we'll get to in a bit. On the other hand, in terms of SRs, well, why did I click on this then? That doesn't need to be there. Darn it. I got a way to go because either A, I need her ascension materials, or I just haven't fully leveled them. I got one ascension material for, let's see. Um, one is such a material left for Sieg, and Mecha Elijon. If I get there, uh, I mm, hope to eventually we'll figure out what to do for like such, because other welfares I've missed are Chloe von Einsvern, um, Caster Shooten and Christmas Kets. I have an ex I have a reason for Christmas Kets, not ex uh, exactly a reason for Shooten. Okay, fine. First, we'll explain the reasons in order. Caster Shooten, I did not get all because Only Land was very difficult for me at the time. I was a dumbass. Caster Kets, um. During the Christmas event, I started going through some stress, and I don't think doing a lot of box event could considerably be to such. Although also during that time, Salmon came out in um and DNA server, so take that as you will. Um, for Chloe, it was during the time where my body was well. Like, how do I say this? Fine. A few times in, a few times from the end of December to middle of January, I was in a hospital three separate times for medical reasons. 
which affected technically too well technically affected my mental health and my well-being and such such when you have two events happening during around these times it's kind of unfortunate so yeah that's his long story also, I still failed, and yes, I still failed to get Columbus or red hair. I feel so sad about it. On the other hand, I am not going to roll on the dreader thing, so let's get on to acquisition for an order of the salon story short. December 12th is when I started playing this game, as I mentioned, but there's something else. Abigail Williams was the first SSR I ever pulled. And the first care, and when I first looked at her design, I thought, is she from Princess Principal? Then I realized that the, then I eventually learned, because I was a moron, that the character designer for Princess Principal also did the light novel illustrations for Kino's Journey and the Sword Online spin off, Sword Online, Sword Art Online, Gun Gale, okay, Sword Online Alternative Gun Gale Online. Yeah, when you have a long title, sometimes you're going to butcher it. So, I eventually realized it, and the illustrator also did Hokusai in this game. Which made me happy, but I wish to get Hokusai at some point. Just because I love the designs. And I got some luck. During this point, I got some SRs. I didn't level Rama up until like, like five months ago, and that was long after I finished Kamala, so I'm a moron. Not sure why. Maybe I forgot that Rama was existed. I apologize, Rama. I'm a moron. And see, I guess it. So during this time, so during the gaps between my first and second and stars, Ushi Wakamaru and Rockman Hood showed up. They are the saviors of this account. His wife, both of them, are getting two grails each. Robin Hood received a second grail. Ushi has not. And also, both of them are pretty easy to get to leveling up. So I immediately put a grill on Ushi once I realized how quickly she got to level 80 on the same day, less than an hour after she got to level 70. I swear about that. Now it has to do with her leveling curve. So during the Da Vinci rerun of it, basically the um, event with the True and Thick Lottos, I really should have went a bit more hammy on that. If I knew that I was going to get a lot of stuff that I eventually was going to save my ass later... And I failed to get the Shinjuku outfit for John Arc Alter, which stinks for me. Don't forget to get your costumes. You may never, there won't be a rerun for them last, as far as I know. So get them, darn it. Similarly, I didn't get costume for other reruns. <laughs> and that was my last SSR for a few months. It was depressing. I called John the Ark out, or at some point started calling her Queen of Salt. And then I realized that during the Da Vinci event at NA, I realized that the Queen of Salt nickname is literally accurate. So much salt happened on the first day of the Da Vinci event in NA, you have no idea. And eventually, so yeah, other events happened. I failed to get stuff that I wanted. Like Sherlock Holmes, for example. Thank you, Anna Mary, for spooking me. It wasn't fun. And during other events, I failed to get somebody. Although I wasn't realize that Hichikata was the servant because I didn't look on the wiki because I'm a moron. Well, there goes that. And my next SR happened around the first and the third anniversary. When Slawsville 2 existed... The first banner happened, I took a single look at this extension and wanted and almost got a boner. I'm a female and I almost got a boner after checking the wiki for this man, who eventually found out was a dork. But I love dorks, so I'm okay with this. And so I rolled like, at least like, uh, darn it, stupid notification. Dan, you didn't see that. Ugh, God. That's the thing. I don't turn notifications off because I don't... Because oh, I'm supposed to do this. That's going to drive me nuts. There. Um, I am doing my 
best to make sh I'm not sure which servant of mine is going to get to bond level 10 first. Because John, the Ark, Alter, and Abby both got to bond level 8. So, so group we have a lot of time catching. Anyway, 60 quarts, at least fifth, a lot of quarts were used. Even we started if we lost about one, but then towards before in the first, then I got him. I cried. And then one, then the next day, I think, was the, th no, the start of the third anniversary, I got my second copy from a multi. I was confused, I was crying, and I didn't care. I was confused too, but then I realized that this was the best decision of my life. So yeah, that fixed that. Guaranteed gotcha happened. And this is where my luck started getting good. It also got good for my alt account too. An A account, because that got Lance Artoria. I got Gilgamesh from the Guaranteed SSR. To people who think that Gilgamesh could ruin your luck, the opposite happened to me. Where I literally got Gilgamesh on August 1st. And then my luck gained good for the next two days. Because during Tesla's, I rolled. I did not get Tesla, I got Skahawk Scotty. I didn't mind this. But then I learned that she can eat your QP. Because I made the dumb mistake, because I wasn't sure if getting, but then I, because I needed to get her third skill to bomb level 10. I'm not sure if it's worth it, but I don't mind. Because at least I got a six turn cooldown. Next day, did a single on Cool Outer Spanner. Got nothing. Did a single on Meep Spanner. You can figure out what happened. Meep, why? Then a summer event happened. I did my best to not, but I did not get a summer servant. Until after, until like the event was like basically over because 15 million downloads campaign happened. I got Ruler Marfa. I am okay with this, although my LJP account has way more um, summer servants than I do, which is weird. But my sister probably had good luck because she was manning that account for a good while. And so we come straight to the next SSR I ever got. I was basically like done extending. It's like, okay, game, give me another SSR. I don't have any other SSRs to level up because they take my priority more. As weird as it is. Oh, I also got one more. Also, I got one more ascension material for um, Archer Altero de Santa. Yeah, that pun is terrible. Altero de Santa. That is a legit terrible pun. I like bad puns, but that was complete terrible. Why game? So that related to her event, and as you can figure out, I got the clay. I knew it was going to happen at some point because I have Gilgamesh. But I ain't Keto okay? And I didn't mind. Because I, there's nothing wrong with needing a Buster Lance, uh, Buster Lancer. New Year's happened. If you saw my Guaranteed Gadget video, I apologize. I used a recorder where it didn't exactly help as much. In terms of, like, not realizing that I can just turn it off and my audio won't be recorded, so you can just hear the game itself. I'll try not to do that again, but I was a moron who didn't know this. So forgive me. Anyways, yeah, I got Arthur from Net. Like, less than three hours late, like a couple hours later, I was leveling up working on Arthur. I decided to roll some Tumba tickets. I had 15 Tumba tickets because it was New Year's. And got to her. And we don't need to say anything, because simply put, which ascension is less an SFW? It's beyond me. Point taken, she can't be an SFW protection. <laughs> but the FGONA is not going to censor her. I know this, because this will be dumb. And fans of her, for her, p well, she does have fans somehow. Will not be happy if she gets censored. So it's not gonna happen. And then I then we got thirty quarts on this on the login. So I was at the gas so I was at a gas station in the car because I was gone from home the entire day, hence why I wasn't home to record my guarantee gacha. If that made any sense, I was in the car, hence why I heard the radio. And 
I was sitting at a gas the car and the gas station because um the person that it drove was driving um had to get something I think. So I ended up logging in, getting the 30 cores, did a multi, and um realized the game servers were so were um kind of bad, so I closed out of the game after two minute one minute. Reopened my game, didn't say anything out loud because let's face it, I wasn't the only one in the car at that point. And I was crying on the inside because I got Benny Emma on a multi and I didn't get to see what kind of role it was. But I was okay with it because I ended up looking up what her summoning line was immediately afterwards. And she's adorable. This guy, yeah, the scariest character designer loves me. A character summers love me. And I'm okay with this. Yeah, I guess that's Wu Zetian and Benny Emma's artist. Yeah, during the Prisma Lee events I mentioned, yeah, this was when I was recovering my mental state, so forgive me. CCD happened, didn't I get an alter ego? And this was the point where I realized I need an alter ego. So I did my best to roll for King Queen King Protea because there were because the two servants that came with King Protea, I actually wanted being Gwen and Tristan. Didn't get either. However, I did got the ones that came with Zuzika goes uh, with um, Melt, so I'm okay with it. And I did, yeah, I got Gibi on the last eight events, so that was kind of awkward and terrible. Now let's cut to a few days after the event ended. With the Moriarty event. Unfortunately, I did not get Moriarty. I was sat on the inside and literally weeping. And not to worry, because my luck started getting good. The night before I rolled for Tesla, my luck in bowling was pretty bad. So the game decided to cheer me up by giving me Tesla. Next day, I was in the car, skipped, and didn't realize it was Karna. I was crying on the inside because I wanted him ever since I started playing this game. Then a couple days later, I... Because the day after Karna was, um, excessively shooing, and apparently he didn't like me, so I stopped rolling for two days. I did. And I ended up rolling for Kualter. Did a single. It was 1 p.m. I got him, so I was happy. And then a day later, I got Waver. Oh, yeah. Did you know? That? Oh, yeah. Karna wasn't. It did got Karna again key to his raid ups today, so take it as you will. It was a happy spook. Waver, I got him. And I was crying on the inside because I wanted this man to. And then let's cut um, probably um, over a month later during the case files event. Oh, yeah. Cop. Oh, yeah. After I got away from my event, my targets were Moon Cancer, Alter Ego, and Assassin for SSRs. Those are the only three classes I do not have. During case files event, did a single. Oh, well, I was still I was looking for the five star waiver CE. I got everything else off that banner, which included Astrea, which was the day after I got rains, which I just realized. I got rains on a Sunday. I got Astrea on a Monday, and it was this week. I did not care. And that was my story of my account overview. Whether or not this will fully get recorded is based off anything to go by. But hopefully you enjoyed this overcount overview. Oh, by the way, Lost Bell for when I might have to start clearing out these free qu every free quest. And I gotta finish three 1.5 singulars. I am not looking forward to viewing the rest of them. Well, Salem, I'm fine with. I am not okay with the rest of Shimosa, though. So, yeah, I'm gonna get a lot of quartz by Lost Bell 4. That is a fact. I know this was a bit long, but I had, but I couldn't help but ramble, so forgive me. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you want, um, do whatever the heck you want. I don't mind. And I might do this for NA once second anniversary comes out. Because there's something I really want to do for that. And you can kind of guess what it is. But it won't be exactly on the anniversary date itself. 
Well, I would go on a account overview on second hand anniversary for NA, but for servant as I'm right up, I am not doing it until um, at some point. Because I wanted to roll for two servants at once. Hopefully for the deal. And I will see you in the next video I record, which rather will be for boundary. I need to do more abnormal videos. And maybe some maybe girls frontline in the future. Just once I know what the heck I'm doing in that game. Until then, I will see you later. Take care.